Hello and welcome back to the Radical Removing. So, last time we had a crusade and, well, you know, we, we, we got our own back. But there's still a little bit that we need to do. We also need to absolutely crush France and things again. But, one good thing to come out of the crusade, well the only good thing I would say, is that it showed us that we cannot fight this whole amount of people. We'll just lose. We just can't fight them. It's not possible. But we can potentially fight some revolts around the place and get some stuff done. How big are our armies? They need some recovering. Yeah, they need some serious recovering. So I think it's recover time for them. Let's have a look at uh, our goal. Because that's always a good thing to look at. Keep our mind focused. So, we've got the land back, which is good. And we didn't lose any provinces, I don't think. I don't think anything converted. Our moral authority dropped a lot, though. As And the Catholic one rose a ton. So ideally, we want to be converting Buddhist or Sunni or anything else, actually. Orthodox, look at that, is down at 23%. So where are we converting right now? We are converting Novogrodek. Where is Novogrodek? Novogrodek's over here. Okay, so it's that one. Um, so I say ideally, we want to be converting Iconoclast now. Although it is a different religion. That's the we have some Buddhist land, don't we? Oh no, we don't have any Buddhist land. Uh, Suwon Mensko? Uh, I think we might have. Like, that might be fairly low. Zero. Yeah, okay, I'd say that's low. So we should probably convert those bits of lands. Uh, so I'll head up here and convert one of those. Right, good. Uh, anything else we need to do? Baltic holds? No. Negotiate? No. Are we injured? No. We should probably fight someone, I'd imagine. Uh, that's generally my, my thought. But that's just because we're in this society. We have to loot where? Oh, right. Yeah, we can do that. Let me find some men. Barcelona. Uh, and Asturias. And Babayos. Sure. Seems like a good time to do it as well. Because everyone's kind of a bit busy. Right. Let's get going. Uh, yep. Everything's fine. Get them all merged up. Reputation has got more people to come and join you. Good, as always. So it's uh, Vivan, or was it Van there? I was adding an extra V, I think. No, it's Vivaris. Vivaris. Oh, it's there. Oh, okay. I would like to loot here. Oh, this is a separate place. Oh, okay. This is Burgundy. Burgundy, you sly people. You snuck in. Look at that. They, they, they're blending in. They're pretending to be part of our empire. If you squint, you can't see them at all. My god, they're good. They discovered the secret. If they just hide, I can't tell the difference. Okay. Right, uh, yeah, I'm just assuming I don't want that betrothal. Whatever it is. Averis was filled with treasure. 250 gold. Ooh, nice. On top of the 89 we got for just going there. That's fantastic. We can usurp the kingdom of Bohemia? Interesting. How many kingdoms does he have? One. Okay, so what would happen if we usurp the kingdom of Bohemia? Well, I mean, all of Bohemia up here becomes independent. Like, all of it becomes, like, single province people. That's a very interesting uh, concept. Duchy? Don't care. I see, who holds the duchy? I do kind of care. Hmm, Duchy's held by him. Hmm, okay. So we could break him, then instantly declare a war upon the fragments? That's a tempting thing to do. That's very tempting. Do we have any need for a Bohemia, though? No, we have no need for a Bohemia. Uh, because a de jure Bohemia is there, which is German, Germany and Poland, which is going to cause us an issue. But, you know, there we are. Uh, we'll just have to live with that, I think. But I'm not going to do it right now anyway. We don't have the money. We have to pay for our retinues to reinforce, which costs a lot. Let's just put it that way. Uh, let's half our retinue reinforcement rate, just so we don't run out of money instantly. We are running out of money quickly. Yeah, 83. So halving that's gonna... Yeah, half our biggest expense by a significant amount. So, let's have a look at that. Uh, one of my marshals became better. That's the ecumenical patriarch. Uh, how much are we going to lose at the end of this month? 23. That's much more reasonable. That's almost in the bit where we can raid to keep up with it. 
But, you know, the other one was just way too large. Way too large. Right. We inherited a barony of Grimaud. Okay. So, I probably just want to give that away. Yeah. But the nice thing about inheriting the barony is that we should... Yeah, we got some money. Nice. What else do we hold? Well, it's not worth a lot. This one? That's under our capital. Oh, is that new? No. No, it's not new. I just haven't been utilizing it, I think. Uh, for whatever reason. Mm, everything else makes money. I'll keep it, even though we're slightly over our domain limit. That's fine. We're only over because we're stressed or something, right? I think we are only over because we're stressed. Uh, no. No to that marriage. Right. We got another 100 uh, gold. Lovely. Burgundy is an untapped market for our money. You can verse with a single uh, subject. Ooh, there's an Aquitaine now. All sorts of interesting colors happening now. Arrange betrothal. You would like to marry my daughter. Mm, no. Alright, that was easy enough. Next one. We actually have a reasonable amount of money now as well. Are we making money now? No. Still not making money. Retinues are still reinforcing, so we're fine. Temples have been usurped. How much is our threat? 66%. So it's not that bad. It's just, a, you know, it was getting down to very low points. Now it's just not there anymore, which is fine. Actually, I'm going to head to Provence. Uh, am I leading? No, I should definitely be leading so I can get some uh, extra people captured. That's fine. Uh, you know, I actually kind of like the idea of the Ecumenical Patriarch joining in on our raids. So I'll keep him doing it. Uh, do we caught any prisoners? We have a lot of prisoners. We should get some money for them. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we've been up all night again. Do I want diligent or a chance to lose stressed? Uh, I want diligent, please. I did not get diligent, but that's fine. At least I don't think I got diligent. No, I didn't. That's fun. That's a lot of money we just got. Oh, wow. You don't usually get that much money because it's usually all the same person, but I guess like all the ransoms are the same person, but this time seven of them weren't. That's nice. That's a good chunk of money we just got there. Nice. Um, Got any more? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's one way to pay for uh, wars, isn't it? You know, I'm going to set retinue reinforcement back up to full. I think we can afford this. Okay, good. Uh, we've built our war chest as well. Fulfilled our ambition. 10% more um, revenue. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, see the realm prosper seems like the obvious choice here. We do lose a lot of money having him fully reinforced, but I think it's worth it because I'd prefer to look stronger. Uh, I'll probably stop when we have about 400 and then uh, we'll go back to doing it slower. That's fine. Continue getting money. Uh, can oh no, there's another one coming. Yeah, there we go. And then these people, uh, we'll just convert or whatever. Boom. So search court or imprison. Yes. Can't convert. Uh, wait, is my religion? Oh yeah, you you can just go. See ya. Right, you. Uh, can't convert. Guess you're getting sacrificed. Sacrificed. Uh, sacrificed. Sacrificed. Cool. Bunch more sacrifices. There we go. That, that worked for me. Somebody created a high chiefdom. Not worried about it. Ooh, about to get some money from Burgundy. It's got 106 gold and two prisoners. Uh, neither of which can get us any money, but let's have a look at them. 34, will not convert, right? Um, five years. We could change our childhood focus to faith and try and get her to adopt our religion. Is she even in line for anything? I guess, maybe. Yeah, I guess going in a way that does lead up. I'm, I'm going to set, set her thing to faith. Yeah, sure, we'll try it. Right. Uh, and we'll leave her there. If she hasn't converted by the time that she comes of age, then we kill her. The easy answer. Uh, right. Arrange patrol, though. Uh, no. Right. Oh, did we capture anyone else in that next one? Nope. Okay, I don't think we actually had a next one, now that I'm looking at it. Cathar Heresy has appeared. <sighs> Alright, well, whatever. Hopefully it appeared, it's probably appeared in Christian lands, I'd imagine. I'm gonna make my son a commander. Nice thing about that, even if I don't use him, is that he will get better with uh, this martial thing, so that seems fine. Right. 
Vidimantis uh, is my grandson's name. My son's uh, my son Mercellus is the son called Vidimantis. Could have said that in an easier way, but there you go. Right. Ooh, we got some more money. Lovely. And any more prisoners? Nope. Okay, that's fine. Carry on. Uh, you would like me to practice with High Chief uh, Gilzevert. 79 personal combat skills. So he's better than I am. But you know, maybe that's good. Maybe I can then have a challenge. I will duel you. Fantastic. A simple sparring match or not. High Chief Gillis Vert had an air of unquestioned confidence about him. When I charge, he snickers. At the end of it, I'm lying on the ground after my opponent made sure to smack his dull spear into the side of my head. We lost the duel. We become wounded once more. Oh, now we're, now we're like, very wounded. Oh, wow. Oh, no, I think we were just stressed before. Now, now we're wounded. Yes, okay. That does look... That looks like a vicious wound. Ooh, Asturian, Asturian Holy War on Aquitaine. I like it. I like it. 16,000 versus... 1,000, expand our realm. Ooh, you converted it. Lovely. I told you that was the right province to convert. Right, next one, uh, we'll do another one. I think this one was... Yeah, that one will do. Right, uh, that one's also Sumamensko. Right. Uh, and there's a German holy war on Bavaria, which does not look as good. It's actually... No, 20,000 versus 7. Never mind, that looks great. Now, the thing about the Holy Wars is obviously some other people can join, but if we get enough Holy Wars, we're going to spread them apart. We're going to vassal swarm them. Russ is promoting vile heresies. Is she? Uh, Whatever. That's fine. As long as she's not actually spreading the religion, then I don't care. As in, she's not officially spreading the religion. Oh, Italy's expanding to Favaris now. Oh, Burgundy's being eaten apart by Italy. Wait, is that Burgundy there? That is... Wait, no. That's Germany. Never mind. See, I can't even tell Burgundy apart from my own lands, apart from this tiny little bit there, and that was mountains I was looking at. Okay, not... Different... Not not actually our borders. That's fine. Um, My Chancellor kindly suggests there would be a benefit to the realm if I studied the languages spoken at foreign courts. Sure, I'll get a learning. Although that wasn't returned for a favor, which isn't so good. Rank up in a society? Oh yeah, I'll rank up. Do I have to fight him? I hope not. I would like to rank up. Yes, I would like a... Um, would I like to duel... Oh, I have to duel him? Oh, never mind. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I want to duel you. My spear gleamed in the light and the ground felt firm beneath me. I moved gracefully and brought my spear down upon him. They fended off the first blow, but not the second. After my duel is done, I wipe the blood off my spear. Hmm. Do, do I make a worse person be in charge of our holy order just so I can get another kill on the board? Yeah, of course I do. Hail, hero. While we mourn the loss, know that by defeating war chief Nuziana, you have more than proven yourself worthy of the title you wish to acquire. Use it well. Signed, Hero Visvaldus. Oh, nice. So we are in our max rank. So what does that get us? It gets us indomitable. So we no longer suffer lethal injuries in battle. Huge. We can call to arms on our society. We can choose a military aspect. Oh, okay. So I need 150 renown for that. And we have to not have a lifestyle trait. Which we don't. Which is good. I guess. Oh no, we have a rash. You think it's nothing. Oh, that's good. And he gave us excellent treatment symptom. What? Or, or treat, uh, treatment. Anyway, whatever. Symptom treatment. That's what I was looking for. Pomerania has usurped the city. Another city. Oh, that means he actually took land. The county of Heves. Or Heves. Heves. All right. That's not bad. They took it from Pest. So now Pest is just a single one. Pest is now Pest. That's it. That's all they have. Cool. Ooh, free money. And, uh, yeah, our threat has dropped since we started, but it is, you know, it's it's not dropping as quickly as it could. Let's put it that way. We're about to be attacked by some troops. Not overly worried about it. We should win. We did. Ooh, already converted that province. That's, a, that's two we've already gotten today. That's not bad. Where do we want to convert next? Uh, how's Tengri looking? Tengri... 
how, no, it can't be this far down. Oh no, it's here. Zero. Yeah, so Tengri is another good one. Which is that province. Yeah, we'll get him to convert. Oh, I actually can't tell him to convert. He did it too quickly. Ooh, another special tithe. Uh, her favorite toy is missing. Oh well. There's no winning that one. That's just a straight up bad event. We captured someone. Uh, yeah, obviously sacrifice him. Uh, yeah, convert over there. Right. Uh, next one, I need you to get an education. Let's give you a... Uh, you're my son. You're getting a martial education. Everyone's getting a martial education. Betrothed? Nope. Not interested. Right. Um, over here, we won our battle so we can continue sieging, which is nice. You deserve some recognition. No. Uh, I am better. I no longer have a rash. Well, isn't that great? That is fantastic. Novgorod has been usurped, well, not usurped, inherited, because the person in charge of Novgorod is dead. Our daughter finished her education. She seems alright. Let's give her a matrilineal marriage to... Um, I don't know. There's so many options. All of them my dynasty. Uh, let's choose age. Let's use that instead. Then go down here. Uh, quick. Yeah, you marry the Prince of Frisia. And we get prestige somehow for it. For marrying into our own house, we get prestige. That, that, that seems a little bit odd. That does seem very odd. Okay. Anyway. Right. Ooh, another 91. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Okay, this one's finishing. And we've got another one done there. 73. News from China. Um, the Heavenly Emperor must currently have more important matters to deal with than the war against King Chonzu of Zayu. Why else would, Tang, would the Tang Empire negotiate with their aggressors? Reports state the Han armies are pulling back from Zayu as a white peace is being established. Ooh, he, he won. Oh no, he died. Never mind. It just... Okay. It just got invalidated. Anyway, I am going to end the episode a little bit early on this one here. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.